Hello everyone! Welcome or welcome back here on my channel. This is me once again, Teacher Jinjin, your virtual teacher here on YouTube. Kung bago ka pa lang sa channel na ito, gumagawa ako ng mga Tagalog tutorial videos mula grade 7 hanggang grade 11. Kung interesado ka, please like, subscribe, at i-click mo na rin ang notification bell para ma-notify ka kapag may bago akong upload na video. Let's proceed naman sa number 3. So, let m of x equals square root of x plus 3. n of x equals x cubed ito. x cubed minus 4 and p of x equals 9x minus 5. Find m circle of n minus p of 3. So, ang gagawin natin dito, isolve muna natin yung nasa loob, yung n minus p. So, that is n of x minus p of x. Tsaka natin i-substitute yung 3. Or pwede namang diretso, it-substitute nyo na agad yung 3. So, ang n of x natin ay x cubed minus 4 minus ang p of x natin ay 9x minus 5. And then, equals x cubed minus 4 Negative times 9x equals negative 9x. Negative times negative 5 equals positive 5. Then combine like terms. x cubed minus 9x. Negative 4 plus 5 equals positive 1. So ito yung nasa loob yung n minus p. Ngayon, n minus p of 3. So n minus p of 3 naman. Palitan natin ng 3 yung x. So, that is 3 raised to 3 minus 9 times 3 plus 1. 3 times 3 equals 9 times 3 equals 27 minus 9 times 3 equals 27 plus 1. Simplify 27 minus 27 equals 0. Then, ang matitira is positive 1 lang. And then, m compose ito. So, ano yung m natin? That is m circle n minus p of 3 is equal to square root of x plus 3. So, ito yung, ang value nito ay ito, ba? Kaya palitan natin ng 1 ito. So, square root of 1 plus 3. 1 plus 3 is equal to 4. And the square root of 4 is equal to positive 2. Now, let's proceed sa number 4. Given wx equals 3x minus 2, v of x equals 2x plus 7, and k of x equals negative 6 minus 7, find w minus v minus k of, papalitan ko ito ng 3. Yan. Para ma-challenge kayong ma-isolve yung 2. So, ang gagawin lang natin is subtract natin yung w of x minus v of x minus k of x muna. Tsaka natin i-multiply sa 3. w of x equals 3x minus 2 and then minus 2x plus 7. Maglagay palagi ng parenthesis kasi mag-iiba ng sign kapag hindi dinire-diretso nyo. Minus ang k of x natin is negative 6x minus 7. Then simplify 3x minus 2, maglagay ng equal sign. Yung negative, distribute natin magiging negative 2x, negative times positive 7 equals negative 7, negative times negative 6x equals positive 6x, negative times negative 7 equals positive 7. Nasundan ninyo. Combine like terms, 3x minus 2x equals x plus 6x equals positive 6x plus 7. Then, palitan na natin ng 3 yung x. Kasi, 3 ito. Alright? So, magiging 3 times 3 minus 2 minus 2 times 3 minus 7 plus 6 times 3 plus 7. Simplify, 3 times 3 equals 9 minus 2. Negative 2 times 3 equals negative 6 minus 7 plus 6 times 3 equals positive 18 plus 7. Then, simplify. Pagsamahin muna natin yung mga positive. 9, 9 
plus 18 equals 27 plus 7 equals 34. And then ito naman, so 34 yun. Negative 2 minus 6 equals negative 8 minus 7 equals negative 15. So 34 minus 15 is equal to 19, positive 19. Our final answer is positive 19. Again, inibahan ko yung given na value dito. So, kayo na ang mag-solve kung ano yung positive 2. Alright? So, let's proceed sa number 5. Papalitan ko ulit to ng 3. So, we have a given if S of X equals 3X minus 2 and R of X equals 2 over X plus 5, find 3 times S plus R of X. So, ang gagawin natin dito, i-add muna natin yung function. So, that is simply means S of X muna plus R of X. So, that is equal to, ang S of X natin is 3X minus 2 plus, ang R of X natin is 2 over X plus 5. So, ang gagawin natin dito, since rational expression to, get the LCD. So, let's say may positive 1 dito. Ang LCD ng 1 at x plus 5 ay x plus 5. So, x plus 5 divided by 1 equals x plus 5 times 3x minus 2. So, 3x minus 2 times x plus 5. Plus, x plus 5 divided by x plus 5 equals 1 times 2 equals positive 2. Parang nag add din ng fraction. Next, simplify natin to. Gamitin natin yung FOIL method. 3x times x equals 3x squared. 3x times positive 5 equals positive 15x. Negative 2 times x equals negative 2x. And negative 2 times positive 5 equals negative 10. Then, i-add natin to plus 2 all over x plus 5. Combine like terms. So, that is 3x squared. 15x minus 2x equals positive 13x. Negative 10 plus 2 equals negative 8 over x plus 5. Ngayon, ang gagawin ulit natin ay imumultiply pa natin siya sa 3. So, multiply this by 3. 3 times 3x squared is equal to 9x squared. 3 times 13x equals positive 39x. 3 times negative 8 equals negative 24. All over x plus 5. Alright, so palitan nyo na lang ito ng 2 at i-comment nyo sa baba kung ano yung sagot ninyo. Lastly, number 6, we have a of x equals 4x plus 2, b of x equals 3 over 2x, and c of x equals x minus 5. Find a times b times c of x. So, ang gagawin natin dito, imumultiply lang natin itong tatlo. Ang imumultiply ko muna ay yung a of x tsaka yung c of x gamit ang FOIL method kasi mas madali bago natin imultiply sa b of x. So, a of x times uh, c of x. So, that is 4x plus 2 times ang c of x natin is x minus 5. FOIL method tayo, 4x times x equals 4x squared. 4x times negative 5 equals negative 20x. 2 times x equals positive 2x. 2 times negative 5 equals negative 10. And then ito, i-multiply natin siya sa 3 over 2x. So, 3 over 2x. So, ito, i-distribute natin dyan. 3 times 4x squared is equal to 12x squared. 3 times negative 20x equals negative 60x. 3 times positive 2x equals positive 6x. 3 times negative 10 equals negative 30. Uh, may x pala dito, so magiging 30x ito. Ito naman ay squared at ito ay cube. Pasensya na na nakalimutan. All over 2. Alright? So, simplify. That is equal to 12x raised to 3. Negative 60x squared plus 6x squared is equal to negative 
54x squared minus 30x divided by 2. Divide natin sa 2. So, 12x cubed divided by 2 equals 6x cubed. Negative 54x squared divided by 2 equals negative 27x squared. And negative 30x squared divided by 2 equals negative 15x. Ah, x lang ito. 15x lang. Alright? So, this is now the final answer. So, yun lamang sana nakatulong itong video na ito sa pagsagot ninyo sa mga modules ninyo. Once again, stay home, stay safe, stay healthy at mag-aaral lang mabuti. God bless you all and goodbye!